Hey friends, welcome back to Bit Films. I'm your host Sarthak and you can also call me Ankur. This is a channel where I talk about the Laravel and the cool stuff of the Laravel. So in this episode, we're finally going to learn how to implement middleware, how to use the middleware. So firstly, what is the middleware? A middleware is just a layer between the request and the user. That means whenever there is a request by a user, then request has to go first on the middleware. And when middleware authorizes that request, then it will go to the backend. That means it will give me a layer which filter out my requests. So how will we create a middleware? For that, I will just go to my sublime text. And you can see in the app folder, there's a HTTP folder inside HTTP, there's a middleware folder. And you can see obviously Laravel has some of the middlewares already written. This is for CSRF token. That means if we have CSRF field in our form or not, it will check that. This middleware is used to trim the spaces before or after any string. And there is lots of middlewares. So how will we create our middleware? For that, we will go to our command prompt and I will type php artisan make, make what? Middleware. So middleware, please spell it correct. <laughs> okay. Now the name of the middleware is test. So it will create it successfully. Let's see. This is our middleware. Okay. So to test this middleware, we have to make a view. So go to resource folder. In the views folder, I will create a page called about, let's say about, it's about dot blade dot php inside here. I will just copy all the steps from the welcome page to our about page. And instead of this, I will say about, we have to make route for this about page. So let's quickly make a route. Here I will say about, here also I will say about. Now quickly check this slash about, about. Yep, we have successfully created our view. Now we have to make some logic inside our middleware. So let's say I can have an IP of my request. So I will say request and the IP and here I will type if IP is equal to 127.0.0.1 then throw an exception and in that exception you can say your IP is correct okay that means if we are on the correct IP address then this exception will go or otherwise we will go to the request that means requested page okay let's see how will we do that so we have created the logic we have to connect this middleware to our view so how will we connect we just have to say middleware and inside middleware the name of the middleware so let's see what happened when we refresh the page it will give me an error it simply want to say that whatever you have typed here i don't understand that that means actually what happened is that we have created the middleware but we have not informed the laravel that hey laravel we have created a middleware please consider it also so for that we have to register our middleware for that we will go to app folder http folder and you can see kernel.php so go down and you will find here protected route middleware now register your middleware and you can say test and your address that is app http middleware and test and the class of that test now we have created successfully let's go here click refresh and you can see there is an exception which says your ip is correct that means our middleware is perfectly fine now when i change the ip address let's see what happened click refresh and we are on the about page that means if this statement is not true it will go back to this statement so we have our ip address so when this ip address is correct 
it will go give me the exception or you can redirect it also somewhere else let's say we want to redirect return mm, redirect and redirect to where redirect to home page let's say click refresh and you are on the level page so you can say about but it will give you to the level page now when i change the ip address and try to get the about page and yes we are on the about page so i think this is a very basic thing that how to how to make a middleware how to register a middleware how to use a middleware so in the next video we will talk about the advanced middleware system that means some advanced steps of the middleware how we will go on on that fields and we will talk about the roles of the user we will talk about the access controls in the next coming videos of the middleware series so please don't forget to subscribe you can follow me on facebook twitter instagram please share this video with your developer friends so that everyone get knowledge of the best thing that means the laravel i will meet in the next video till then keep coding be happy bye bye